In this video, you will get to know, in detail about, Standard Availability Check, in SAP Business One. SAP Business One, has two options, exist for item availability checking. You can choose, either, the Standard Availability Check, for SAP Business One, or an Advanced Availability to Promise Check. Let's look at the first option, the Standard SAP Business One, Availability Check. Whenever you create a sales order, and enter a quantity for an item, which is greater than the available quantity, for example, the salesperson, has created sales order, for the scanner item, with a quantity of 7, but only 5 are available. The item availability check window, comes up automatically. Several actions are offered in this window. 1. The first option is to continue. This allows you to accept the information, and proceed, without changing the sales order. In that case, the item will be back ordered. 2. The second option, is to change the quantity, in the sales order line item, to match the available quantity. This reduces the order quantity, to the available quantity. 3. If you need more information, before deciding on a resolution, you can choose the option, to display the available to promise report. This provides you, with an at-a-glance report, on stock inflow and outflow, including projections. This report is also available, directly from the context menu. 4. You could also check, quantities in other warehouses. From this report, you can check, and possibly select the quantities, from another warehouse. 5. Sometimes, an item has been set up, with alternate items. When you choose this option, you can check for any alternates, and if one is available, you can select the quantities, from an alternative item. 6. If the item is not available, and no other options remain, for on-time delivery, a customer may decide to, not order that item. One of the actions available, is to delete the item's row, from the sales order. 7. Sometimes, you may see an additional option, change to earliest availability. This option only appears, when the availability date, can be calculated. It copies the earliest availability date, to the row's delivery date. Thanks for watching this video, do write us for any queries.